Hey you guys, welcome back to another episode of the Guild of Dungeoneering. We're going to go ahead and take Kaywin out again. We got 500 gold right now to spend, however, though, so we can expand the guild again. Which is actually uh, pretty outstanding. I'm pretty happy with that. I still don't really want any of these um, other, uh, what are they called, blessings. You know, Trickster's Greed, which is cool. No, I'm not really really interested in them. I still want to unlock more of the rare items, and that's really, this is the last one. And I think that'd be good, you know, that gives us more rare items to work with. And then let's go exploring, and I think we're going to take Kaywin again, because Kaywin's the shit. And I'm calling her her, Kaywin's a girl. This is a girl ranger. Yeah, sure, looks like she had cancer and everything. But you know what? We don't judge here. Plus, so this is in the back in the days and everything. A lot of times people would shave their heads just because they had lice. Let's be honest, you know. They had lice. They got to get get rid of it. That was the only way. They had no special shampoos, you know. So let's go ahead and enter in here, you know. So that's how they dealt with, uh, you know, head lice and things like that. Just shave it off, man. So this is the bald chick. It's just how it goes. Here for the Golden Sun Idol. Just like the last five losers from the Ivory League. Oh, okay, well, I didn't know that. We have to defeat the dragon. You will pay for your greed. Um, where are you at, dude? Are you, um... I think he's going to chase us down. Doesn't he look like he... Yeah, he's going to chase us down. Because it just says defeat him. I guarantee he's running towards us. We have gold coins in the way that I think are going to push us that way no matter what. He's going to move two times, though. And I'd like to get to this chest if I could. Um... Will I be able to? No, I'm not going to. Unless I put down three corridors and then I move one, he moves two. I'd like to take on the jungle warrior instead. I, if I could turn my guy around. I don't think I can. I don't think I can turn my guy around right now. But I can if I link up this chest. And then he'll move two. And then I'll move one. Yeah, I think that's probably the best route. Because once I link these up, he'll turn. There he goes. Can you believe the guild is paying me in turnips just because I'm outdoorsy? <laughs> I can't believe that. Alright, so he's going to move twice, but you know, I, I don't think I could have done anything else. I think I was going to move backwards anyways. So now we got two level ones. That's fine. I can do that to slow him down. Put this one up to, so then I can continue moving forward. And then that'll be good. Let's end turn. Let's go ahead and take out a jungle warrior. That'll look nice stuffed on my, mounted on my wall. You're going to mount and stuff like a human this is a human being it's a it's a ju jungle warrior does not mean that it's like a creature or something that's just sick dude so let's go ahead and uh camouflage we'll block that and then a beat comes in he's trying to get a, put a beat down on us uh i think if we do a piercing shot that's gonna do one two three they'll do three damage at least so three to us two And then uh, we got a claw coming in. We'll go ahead and camouflage that one. And neurotoxin. Well, we could do three again, I guess. I guess that's the best way route to go. And that's that's for the kill, anyways. So, good job, Kaywin. All right, so we could pick up a demon claw. We haven't had one of those yet. I kind of like it. Slice and dice. Maybe I have had it. I don't really remember. Ooh, the noise in here got a little eerie. All right, he's coming for me. The dragons are moving. So we gotta take on a level 2 creature. I think a uh, Rat Berserker sounds pretty good. They have sluggish. Enemy blocks are twice as effective. That sounds pretty tasty to me. Let's put a Gargoyle in front of him. Gotta make sure it doesn't have one with Wandering because then they'll move with the dragon. So I guess, no, I, I guess since the dragon's moving twice, it doesn't really matter. Alright, let's end turn. Why can't I have a pet? Well, I've talked about this. We've talked about the pet problem with you. Okay, when you just cannot, you, we, you cannot be trusted with a pet. Alright, so we got a parry that came in. I think uh, since he's sluggish, this is going to block the whole thing. Yep. And stack a little damage for us. Unfortunately, it can't block that, so let's just go ahead and steelhead arrow it. That's a four damage hit. We're going to lose a card, though. And then the strike comes in, we'll slice that. Now we just need a 3 damage attack. Um, can't block that lunge, unfortunately, so I guess we'll just pierce anyways. Just so we at least we get some damage in on that attack. And then the thrash comes in. However, we got dice, and that's just going to kill him because we got the quick attack. All right. Rat Berserker is dead. And a Fez? 
Kind of cool. Although I do like this a lot better. Does this give us anything else? No, but it gives us Eviscerate, Bleed, and Repel. We haven't had a, a spiky hat. Or not that I remember. I don't remember a lot of things. You know, my, my, my memory is pretty, uh, <laughs> pretty warped sometimes. Uh, my, my ability, my cognitive ability to remember things is just not as, uh, not as it used to be. So let's go ahead and take on a level 3 jungle shaman I think would probably be good and then get that chest. We'll put a rat berserker in front of him and let's do this. Oh, I should have put the gold pouch down at least. That would have gave me like a some gold. Oops. My mistake. Alright, so we got fire weapon coming in. Um, I could block one of them. Not a bad idea. Then I could stack damage. So it's kind of like a one for one trade. And then the chaos comes in. I could block one or I could just go for the damage. I think I'm going to go for the damage because we're going to lose a card anyways. Alright, that was four damage. That's good. And a bleed. If successful. Oh, okay. That's kind of cool. I think we're going to do the bleed. Because this is going to take one damage every round. I like that. And then uh, he should take a damage right here. That bleed. Yep. Now we just got to do two damage. A dice. And that's going to take him. That's going to take him out. Goodbye, jungle shaman. Uh, do we want some scale mail? Possibly. Or a heater shield. I think scale mail. Oh, tenacious. We get tenacious with this uh, wooden shield. But I think the scale mail with the plus two health and counter. Yeah. That's what we're doing. Now hopefully we get an offhand here. Well, we didn't get the offhand, but we have a fury helm, which is kind of cool. I kind of like that. Yeah. Or we take this wise one. Plus one starting hand size. That's kind of nice, but I think I'm going to go with the horned helm. Because I, I do like Fury, you know, that extra damage. And I think we're just going to be taking on the boss here pretty soon. What are these gargoyles? What's their thing? They're brittle. Yeah, let's just take on a gargoyle. I think we're ready to take on the dragon, so. I wonder if I can craft some new armor from their skins. Man, I don't know about this ranger. He wants to mount a jungle warrior. And then he just wants to craft, the, you know, craft armor out of skins of everything. He's a little demented. So let's go ahead and still head arrow this. I think that's the best route. We're going to take two damage, but I don't know. I think it was unavoidable. And dark pack kind of sucks. Um, I guess just wooden arrow because there's, I mean, I don't want to use my pierce right now. One for three kind of sucks, but oh well. He is brittle, so if we do four plus damage, we got to remember we have that. Let's do two for one. Maybe I can stack some damage if I get some camouflages or something. Ah, oh, Mind Blast. Oh my god, this guy is just hitting me so hard. I, I think if I just go ahead and dice... Oh, I have Fury, so I'm going to do three damage right now. That's good. Three damage is almost dead, and then our next uh, hit will be the Pierce. Alright, let's throw that Pierce. A quick attack. Perfect. Yeah, Fury helps out a lot, man. It's a good thing to have. Oh, and Spiky. I do like Spiky. And then we get a bleed and a counter. I do like this. And that's my offhand that I needed. Perfect. All right. All right, dragon. You have nothing on us. Our ranger looks pretty badass now with that demon claw, spiky helm, and a... I mean, well, that uh, horned helm and the spiky shield. That's perfect. Uh, I think we could take on one more gargoyle before we take on the boss. See if we get some better items. If we don't, we can always get some gold or something. All right. Gotta remember, he is brittle, so if we can get a pretty strong attack. Uh, Dice is gonna hit him for four, and that'll hit for brittle, too. Boom! An extra two from brittle. That's pretty good. I went for one hit. That's pretty amazing. Uh, and then let's go ahead and get our bleed in. That's fine. And that's about it for him. I think that's all he, all he wrote. Let's just do a pierce. Quick attack. Goodbye. Uh, we already have a horn helm. Wolf pelt and the uh, red armor. I think I'll just take the gold. Three gold there. Okay. Now I have you. Well, I don't know about that. I think I have you. I have you, Mr. Dragon. Oh, well, that kind of sucks. I think I'll just go for the bleed. Yeah, that sounds good. Yeah, that was a pretty hard hit. Did three damage plus the one from the bleed. So that's four. Uh, we could, uh, I can't block this, unfortunately, because I do want to. So I think I'm just going to go with my harder attack dice so I don't lose that card. Dice him up. Dice it up, my friend. 
And then uh, I think I will camouflage here though. But unfortunately, I'd like to be able to use this spiky a little bit, but I'm not getting a chance really. Stack a little bit of damage, he gets the bleed. Um, a pierce is going to do one, two. And then the bleed is going to kill him. Alright, so that's it. Goodbye, Spadoosh! <laughs> you are dead, my friend. <laughs> wow, we got 4,000 gold! Quite a bore. Oh, not becoming. wow. But what we have here, next in store, That's amazing. We just got 4,000 gold for that quest. Oh my god, we are definitely expanding our guild. It looks like a new character. I think that's what we're doing right now. Oh, we get a garden. That's pretty cool. For the garden here to look at some stuff. Now let's expand this guild here. Um, I think... <laughs> Hold on one second here. Alright, let's go ahead. Uh, people are looking around my uh, closets and stuff like that. But I think I'm going to go ahead. I want to get the Cardamancer. That would be the guy I really want. Yeah, I guess I could go straight to him. I'm really... This has been the one, one of the characters I've been really wanting to play. Um, mainly because of his ability. So let's trust him out. I think uh, we'll get the shapeshifter in here, but we're not going to use him. Yeah, well, I don't even want to hear his is thing. It bird or is it a cat? Is it some weird, goofy-eyed bat? <laughs> weird, goofy-eyed bat. Oh, my goblin half-sister. No, oh, I think it's a... Shifty shapeshifter. Oh, I think it just would have been better to end that little lyric with just shapeshifter. You don't have to say shifty shapeshifter. Anyway, let's expand the guild one more time. Um, we are going for the cardamancer. However, I will want to have more cards, won't I? Yeah, so I'm going to also want... Okay, so let's do this. Let's see what he says about this guy. Let's see. What's in the future for the guild? The cards they say can tell us the answer. Mm. Who will survive or who will be killed? You could simply go ask the Cartomancer. So I think I'm going to name this one, Mar this is our new K-Win. <laughs> it's spelt with a C this time. So new K-Win, at least she looks like a girl this time. That's uh, that's pretty cool. So there's our Cartomancer. But the other thing we really do need with the Cartomancer is um, not the Heart Serum. Because what does Heart Serum do for you? Um, yeah, 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 I don't want it though. I just wanted to know what it does. That's just plus one HP. I don't want the plus one HP. What I really want, I think it's this Trickster's Greed. I think this is the one. Plus one loot choice? No, no, no. We want plus one starting hand is what we're looking for. So we got a Cardamancer. And then I think it's this. I think it's the Crone's Discipline. Plus one hand, uh, starting hand size in battle. Yeah, that's what we wanted to do. So that's going to complete a lot of our uh, Cardamancer abilities because the Cardamancer gets more damage. Uh, let's listen to this. Deep underground in the dwarven mines, be aware there are no warning signs. You could turn around and just walk away and then live to fight another day. <laughs> All right, let's read this. The golden sun idol is ours. This will wipe the smug off their smug ivory league smug faces. I don't know why they wanted this thing so much. It's hideous. It's got stupid eyes and a stupid nose and stupid hair and stupid... Hey, hang on. What's this say on the bottom? It looks like it was commissioned from the Dwarven Mining co uh, conglomeration, conglomerate. <laughs> conglomerate. Sorry, man. I can't speak today. I know that place. It's up way up north. Why is Iverly going all the way up there for their ugly ornaments? Are they in partnership? Is this why they have so much gold? Is this why I don't? <laughs> is there a conspiracy? Is this gluten-free <laughs> gluten diet really helping my digestion? I need answers, damn it. <laughs> Seems it's time to hit them where it hurts. Those dwarves can be sneaky with their clever contraptions. I guess I'll, I'll have to, I'll just have to be sneakier, or cleverer, or cleverer, or just send wave after wave of Dungeoneers. Yeah, the last one sounds good. That's what I've been doing. Let's go ahead and do it. Let's try out the Cardamancer uh, for our last little quest. Let's, uh, yeah, the Mime Patrol, sure, Cardamancer, K-Win, 
with uh, where's my no my friend we are going with tricksters favor plus one loot toy shot no no not tricksters that's what we're doing yeah let's do it all right so we got to defeat a cyclops a one-eyed beast doesn't know how far we are a snack you'll never get past me We'll we'll never never it's never gonna happen huh Hey, you're not too far away. I think uh, I want to make my way over to these chests as soon as possible. Um, is this a good corridor? No, but this this will get me there. And that's good enough. I just want to get there. Let's get to this first one. And then possibly if we have another... Well, we need a better corridor, like a four-way right over here. Uh, so let's take on an albino goblin, tenacious and night owl. Yeah, we we'll kind of have to do it, don't we? All right, let's go. Are the stats right on that albino goblin? Oh, I don't know if they're right. I forgot he's like the card guy. Rules lawyer, what does that do for us? If you have, if you have, if you take two plus damage in a turn, draw a card. So anytime we take two damage, we get an extra card. That's pretty cool. Plus we extra uh, have that. And then the card storm, this is the one I was talking about. You get one magic damage per a card in your hand. So right now, if I used it, I think I get I think I only get three. I'm not for sure. I don't know how it works. Paper shield, uh, block, cards in hand. Wait. Oh, for how many cards are in my hand? But we can't block the lunge anyways. So let's just go with the original edition. We'll do two for two, but we'll get to draw a card also. Keep drawing those cards. So right now he has one, two, three, four, five, six. Well, we got to do five damage to him. So one, two, three, four. I think we're just going to do four at the moment. Um, we can block this. It's not a bad idea, actually. Let's just block it. Then he does some damage to himself. And then maybe we get some card draw here. Oh, yeah, counterplay. You know what? Just play it like it normally is. And I think I'm just going to go ahead and card storm now. Let's go ahead and card storm. Just to get him down uh, to his tenacious. And then we just have to hit him with one card. One card. Well, that's not the card, but, you know, whatever. We'll get Rules Lawyer, we'll get a heart back, and then we have two, three cards now. Um, not a problem. Counterplay, we'll get the kill. So far, liking it, but you could really stack the damage. It's going to be nice later on, this Cardamancer. As soon as I get used to the Cardamancer, I'm not used to him yet. Uh, yeah, Dead Lizard Charm sounds like a good little pickup. And then, uh, hopefully, get a good corridor. Ah, not really. Not really. Nothing to connect that guy over there, and that's really what I want. Um, and nothing to connect down here. So I think we're just gonna take on a Wailing Ghost, Tenacious and Loner, or a Brittle Mummy. I think Brittle is all physical damage though. Take four plus damage in a turn, causes two X damage. You know what? I don't care. I know I say never do this, never go after a level three, but we're gonna do it. I'm level two, he's level three, but we got we're the, we got the Cardamancer. According to the erratic scroll, that large chest should be a level higher. Well, yeah, you know, it should be. Uh, Torment is going to do three damage to us, but we'll get an extra card. Um, we can card storm now, which I don't think is a good idea. We can just original edition, or we can mind strike. I think I'm just going to mind strike. I doesn't sound great, but it, I'll get an, I'll get a lot of extra cards this way. Really stack up that damage a little bit. All right, can we block this? No. So I think this is probably a good time to card storm. Maybe we could just. Heart of the cards, our card flick. Hmm. What is it? How about this focus? Doesn't that sound good? Yeah, they're both a heart, but this is gonna add damage. So let's do let's do a focus, and we get an extra card. So that should be our full deck right now, right? Yeah, that's basically our full deck. And uh, I don't know if this will get the kill, but that's not gonna kill us that way either. So let's card storm. Let's do it. Let's get those cards going. Boom! 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 boom. Oh my god, it's so powerful. Ah, oh, so much fun. Uh, we could card flick for one damage, unfortunately. That's not enough. But he's not going to get the kill either, but he is going to get a heart back. Kind of sucks. Uh, so I think just mind strike and then card flick next turn. Oh, I forgot about the hearts. He got a lot of hearts back. Um, he's going to do two damage to me, so I die. Unless I can do something about this. Card flick is not enough damage, so I have to heart of the cards just to get a heart back. Yeah. I just gotta do it, man. 
Um, and I can't block this, so I just killed myself. Well, no, I didn't. I I'm okay. I can block it. Okay. But we're close to dying, man. I don't know if we're going to survive right now. A heart back won't do it. Um, we need this uh, card storm to be a quick attack, but it's not going to be. I don't have anything that can block this right now. I think I just died. <laughs> I think I think I just learned my lesson and just died. Oh well. At least we got to try out the Cardamancer. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll play better another time. I know I'm making mistakes, but yeah, Across it happens. From far and wide, they come to the kill and want to fight. Sad to see them sliced and diced. Not only once, but twice. Nice. Ah, whatever, man. You always say bad things, you know. You're like the worst gesture. I can't believe you you work with work with us or work for us. Uh, just just so we have a uh, conformity, we're gonna go with. Uh, uh, I don't know. We'll figure out a good name like uh, Waywin. <laughs> Waywin. <laughs> All right, Waywin is now on the team. But I hope you guys did enjoy this episode. If you did, go ahead and hit the like button and subscribe if you like to see further. Thank you for watching and take it easy, guys.